What's happening everybody? I'm Team Kills and what I like to do is make gaming easy. Er. And I got a quick update for you guys. I told you all I'll keep you covered. There are a few things going on Dauntless right now, like now now now. So check your calendars because February 14th, oh, happy Valentine's by the way, until February 27th, there's an event happening called Saints Bond and Treasures from the Vault Overgrowth. It's here too to join our Aether Punk season. I'm calling it the St. Bond's Treasure Trove of Aether Punk Love. Sounds like a spiky pirate hug or something. Anyways, anyways. The Saints Bond event, what this is, is Valentine's Day's gifts in the form of weapon cosmetics. Now, that's love. The way to get these skins is you have to do the contracts that you pick up from the store. Now, this will be in the featured section under contracts. Now this is going to take a while, if you want to get them all. Now each contract wants you to slay 60 behemoths with that weapon. Unless you're with a friend, then each hunt is going to count for two. But if you can't find a friend at the moment, I suggest escalation mode. Now the first section, level 1 to 13, that's going to have 6 behemoths. So you can run it 10 times and you'll be done. The second section, 13 to 50, that's going to have 7 behemoths. So you can do that eight times and then you have like four left over so you can clean up your bounties. So just in case, it might be the best idea to pick your favorite weapon and grind that one out first. Now if that doesn't sound like enough fun for you, Gregory Flint is back with some treasures from the old or overgrowth. Now after you finish the hunt pass, you can pick up contracts from Mr. Flint to get these bonus rewards. These are the rewards from one of the earliest hunt passes. Now, the contracts, they work just like your hunt pass, except it's going to be 200 points to get these Aether Punk bonus cores. Now, there are 15 cores in total, so once you get 15, you've gotten all the special items that you can get. But don't forget, there are premium bounties. Now, if you didn't know, when a new hunt pass starts, you get 24 bounties max. If you saved a ton of them because you finished a little early before, the game will erase all of your extra ones and bring it down to 24. It's kind of to put people on an equal playing field, but the premium bounties, they pass over until your next hunt pass on top of the 24. And you can get one to three per core. So these are a good thing to collect. Now usually, I say take your time, multitask, and most importantly, have fun. But you might not want to take your time on these uh, St. Bond's event, but you do want to multitask, and you do want to have fun. Otherwise, what's the point? But anyways, guys, stay tuned for some more Dauntless coming up and some more other games. Dreams is right around the corner. Actually, it's today too. This is a happy Valentine's Day. But on that note, I really, really hope this has helped. If it has, join the team of Killers. Become a Killer of Teams. Let me know what you're thinking in the comments. It's the best way for us to talk. Keep it easy. And remember, just keep gaming. Yeah, I broke my mic. I'm getting a new one soon. Bear with me, team killers. Bear with me. <laughs>